Ah, the simple life. We crave it, don't we? Yet most of us live anything but simply. Simple is in, complicated is out. We hunger for the simple life because the world has become so complex. We do indeed live in a complicated world with busy lives. Other people in the world seem to know this, even the giants of technology and business. Apple knows this. They're the pioneers of simple. Just pick up an iPad and find one big button. Plug and play is their mantra. Even their company logo is simple. Southwest Airlines knows this. It's one of the most successful and profitable airlines and the most simple. There are no assigned seats, just groups based on passenger arrival times. And the food is minimal and simple. Papa John's Pizza knows this. A simple approach to a simple menu. Focus on one thing and do it well. But what about the church? Most often we are anything but simple. We tend to make everything so hard. One committee after another, complex structures, no easy systems for reaching people, trying to be all things for all people. But the simple life is all around us, but most of us are too busy to notice. If anyone knows simple, it's Jesus. He stepped into a complicated and cluttered world and refused to play by the complex rules of his day. He simply said, Love God with all your heart, mind, and soul, and your neighbor as yourself. Then go forth and make disciples, so that we all live more simply. Bigger is not always better. More is not always better. Maybe we have to grow smaller in order to grow it all. The simple life, that's what Jesus calls us to. Oh, but these are tough things to consider. Are we really being transformed? Are we making or being real disciples? the kind of disciples Jesus made, or is everyone just too busy? This is Mary Jane Cole, Associate Pastor. Join us at 8.30 in the chapel this Sunday as we take a look at what it means to be a simple church in our sermon series, Change the World, Recovering the Message and Mission of Jesus.